start I think with the, the people we've brought in with Jamie and, and Swerty and um, the boys have been working really hard it's um, been a different approach I guess we've changed a lot of things up and that's what we need to do I guess for the future and looking forward and, and the success that we want to bring is we've got to change something I guess and, uh, I feel the boys are looking uh, the feel the quicks are getting big and strong and it's been really good so far the programs are really good and uh, not too sore, we'd be able to back up weeks and build that progression, I guess. I think that's the, that's the big change that we've had is uh, is our recovery. The ice baths every night, was, um, we're swimming uh, after the net sessions. A lot of uh, yoga, a lot of massage, that, that's the one thing that's really ramped up and we talk about in the group about trying to be the world's best and world class and, uh, and that's, a, that's one thing we've got to look at I guess and, and getting through the season, it's a long season and then longer with pre-season working as hard as we are, we've got to look after our bodies and um, everyone's pulling, doing it extra they are and that's what we've got to do to, to succeed I guess at this level. And I think uh, a few of the rookies have been really good. Um, Along with Winters, Nick's been in the system for a few years now, and, but he's been outstanding. His running's next level. It's uh, him and Harry Nielsen. Harry Nielsen, I think, surprised a few with some of the figures he's putting up with his running, and um, he's blown us away. So it's been really good for the young blokes, I guess, to, to see the environment. And, um, it's a new environment for them, and, and they, they're fresh and, and enthusiastic. So it's been really good for the group uh, to go to that next level. I think we're, we're travelling along. Pretty well, I think. We've tried to make a few changes, particularly with a couple of batting techniques, and the bowlers have been pushed. Certainly with uh, fitness, they've been hammered, um, and just the look of the bodies and the way they're, they're all pulling off personal bests and stuff with their fitness training and fitness testing. So I think it's going along well, so we've just got to keep that momentum going. We've jumped straight into, you know, we're trying to pull up about four days of three and a half hours of skill um, with a little bit of fitness training there, and then on the back of that is the is the weight training and the, and the conditioning. So, you know, we're trying. We've got a lot to do. I think we've got a lot to do to progress to where we want to get to, and that's to be the best in the country. Um, so that requires a lot of hard work and, and smart work, and we're, and we're trying to do that now. Yeah, look, we're trying to use other sports, and Rory Sloan from the Crows is just to have another voice that's brilliant, and we're trying to make the Crows feel and Port Adelaide feel really comfortable coming into our environment. Obviously the tie-in with um, Stephen Schwerk, our fitness trainer, is, is, a, is gold for us because the boys feel comfortable coming to us and coming in and saying hello to him. Um, we can tie that in, we can, we can learn from them and them from us I think in the future.